Hello everybody, Aerosef here, back today with some more Catacomb Kids. Let's get started. Today, I feel like playing a poet. Let's see who we got that we can be doing some good stuff as. Hmm. Most of these people don't seem really all that great. This guy's got quite a few, uh, well he's got good uh, stats, like special stuff. Um, magical combat would be pretty good. I'd, I've never used Shadow Cloak before, so let's let's go with this and see uh, how this does. So let's start by immediately getting ourselves this new magic. Mm. Heal will probably be the most useful, even though I'm only going to be able to use that at the beginning. We'll have to go with that. We can open this chest here. Um, boost shoes, actually, I wanna look at those. They aren't giving me anything, but... Are they giving me... You know, I'm gonna take them just because they sound useful. Ah! Don't want to get teleported. Grumbles over here. Ah, lots of grumbles. Ah, grumbles die. No, don't hit me. You're not supposed to hit me. Ooh, I have a clear potion too. I'll store that. And let's see, you guys got anything good? You've got a stronger longsword, but I think I'm good with my hammer. Let's drop that corpse. Let's see, you've got a runic partisan, which gives me more magic and intelligence, so that... This is basically a no-brainer. I have to go with this because it's going to just make me better. Oops. Uh, but this corpse also has a robe on, which will increase my magic and intelligence even further. So, at this point... I'm pretty weak, uh, but I do have, hopefully, a decent bit of... Oh, the spell was interrupted? I didn't know that was possible. Oh well. I want to try another poet. I just, I want to get a good one in, a good poet run. I haven't had a really good poet run ever. I don't know why you would want the damaged axe. This guy's got magic in motion, but he's got really bad things. Gosh, most of these guys kind of suck. Uh, I think I'm going to go with this guy. Even though he's clumsy, he's got the dark arts. And he's got more health than the last guy, so hopefully he'll be a little bit better. He does have a shield, so... Won't be able to do. Uh, excuse me. Suddenly uh, overcome with hiccups again. And die, bat. I can hear the leveling orb already, which is good. Oh, I should probably uh, use my dark arts. Um. Can get raised dead, plague. Um. Poisons and slows, restores health by attacking. You know. I think I'm going to go with Vampirism for now, because uh, this guy is a little bit tankier, and he's got a decent weapon, so hopefully I'll be able to use that. What? I just want to check real quick. What does Temporal Step do? Move quickly, leaving a damaging trail behind. Alright. Sounds pretty useful. Um, I don't, I don't want to see exactly what uh, Clumsy does. Ew, that is a really bad thing. I'm going to have to hopefully find my way to someone who can remove that from me. Oh man, there's lots of grumbles down here. Let's uh, avoid them for now. I guess it's not really that many grumbles, but still enough that I don't want to fight them just Um yeah. 
it would be bad for me to just try to jump down there and fight these guys, especially since I'm clumsy. I mean, yeah, vampirism could help because I could uh, hopefully kill some of them and get some more power from it, but uh, actually, I really want... Ah! No! Oh, crap. Okay, it died. Um, I want that potion back. Uh, gotta get out of here quick. <laughs> Gosh, angry piranhas. Can I jump up there? Yes. So I have a warm pink potion. No idea what this is gonna do. Um, I might as well use the orbital leveling. So I've got. Hmm. Well, since I have vampirism, it might make sense for me to run as a strengthy poet. But this might be kind of weird. We'll have to see. Um, would have higher energy regen that way. No, I think I am going to go with strength, just so that I have that little bit of a Amazing. bonus capability. And so what I'm going to do... I'm going to uh, activate vampirism, then jump down here. Yeah, well, that was easy. These guys just didn't notice me. Am I, I thought I was supposed to be clumsy. Wow, that really tumbled me. No, don't kill me. You're not allowed to do that. Okay, that healed me. Good to know. Rotten ball of goo, don't want. Grumble corpse, what do you have? Nothing. And what do you have? A runic halberd with really good defense. Which I'm definitely going to take. That's a much faster, more useful attack, I think. Um, I'm going to go with eating just bats for now, see what that does for me. If I can. Uh, right. hate that you trip over stuff so much in this. I'm really worried about what this pink potion is. I don't want to take it and then just die. I need to get away from these bats. They are in a bad range for me. There we go. Gosh, this guy is just staying away from where I can hit him. And I don't really need to fight that slime, although he's probably going to jump at me right here. So I'll kill him. Uh, ooh. Wonderful. Curé of Reflection versus my Smooth Jacket. Smooth Jacket is just Wonderful. better. The Curé of like, Reflection may give a bit more defense, but getting better stats from the other stuff I have. Alright, that bat is dead. Let's make sure this slime dies when it jumps up here. Get over here. Ah, die, Grumble. Alright, nothing there, nothing in this little room. We head down, there's the exit. I want to do a little bit more exploration though in case we can find some good treasure. Doesn't look like there's anything. There's a little something down here, but... Get out of the poison! There we go. And... A short sword of stopping, which would give me more speed but less magic. Not really worth it. And let's go on to the floor two. Mm. You gotta just, oh gosh. Oh no, this is really bad. Well, 
There was no getting away from that. He he knocked me down and I just rolled all the way over there. Alright, well let's try to do one more run. We'll do a bully. Because we know bullies generally do pretty well. Hmm. This guy's good with daggers. He's got a sigh. This guy likes spears. This guy's got more health, so I probably won't play as this guy because he's only got two. Doesn't really seem all that useful. Buzzing longsword or a stick of heat. <laughs> That's silly. Um, I think I'll go with this person. Alright. So let's head down into our catacombs today. What do we have? I'm not going up that way. Well, there's a leveling orb already. And got a ball of goo. Eat that. I'm gonna try to eat a meal of entirely green goo. I, I know I always say that I'm gonna try to eat a meal of entirely one thing and it just doesn't really happen usually, but I'm gonna do it this time. I'm gonna make sure I do. Except for the green ones aren't dropping anything. Orb of leveling, what do we get? Uh, let's go with defense make ourselves a bit tankier and disarm because that's such a useful so shiny. thing for surviving combat um, does not look like I can continue forward this way so I have to go through this crappy path of spikes which means I'm very likely going to die trying Yeah, this is going to be... Oh, I made it. Yay. Kill all that crap. Any... Aw, oh, dang it. No balls. No ball of goo. Uh, oh, well. Moving on. There's a grumble up here. Uh, which I don't have the special attacky uh, thing, but oh well. Green potion, or verdant potion, as the game calls it. Let's see, what do you have? You have a, bless a breastplate that'll give me more strength, less speed. I think I want that. And then, dang it, where'd that corpse go? I want the corpse. I'll take the key and unlock the door. Oh, I, I don't know where the key went. There we go. Ah! Well, that's that's the first time I've ever seen that trap. Uh, bloody Grumble Corpse. What kind of sword did you have? Runic Longsword? Not useful to me. So I've never seen this kind of trap here before. This is... Oof. Oh, gosh! Oh, no. I'm, I'm so dead. I need to run and not die. Uh-oh, I just heard my cats knock something over. What are they getting into? An arrow? I want the book. Alright. I can't use any of this. I don't want this book. Oh my goodness, I am so close to dead. This isn't even funny. Let's get the hollow star and see if we can get any, uh good stuff from this. Uh, you know what? Uh, I have no idea what I want to do. I guess I could drop down here and try to drop this verdant potion on these guys. Or I could just leave, but... Ah, well, they're on fire, which is good. I've only got one health, though, so if I get hit, I'm dead. Disarmed him. And he's dead! Yes, I am victorious over these guys. Uh, hell, why not? I'm not sure what that did. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, Grumble Corpse, you got anything? Plate mail, more defense, even less speed. Let's go with it. Uh, oops. Um, more strength, less speed. Let's go with it. Well, then again, this buzzing one is, is uh, stunning, Yay! then. 
Dang it, I wish I could find... <sighs> Dang it. I don't think it's going to be possible to grab this other grumble corpse in this corner. Just because of the way everything is stacking up. Oh, uh, well, whatever. I'll ignore it. Do you have anything? Just shoes. Open the chest. Precise Bardiche. With that extra luck, I think this Yay! is worth it. It's a bit slower, but... I think it could be useful. Let's go back up and get my star. I'll see what happens if I absorb everything over here. And use it. Uh, my magic flashed, but other than that, I don't think it had any effect. Let's move on. We're gonna die, probably, but oh well. Uh, nothing that way. It's a grumble. Oh crap, that didn't work. Huh. Well, he broke that. I don't know what it did. Oh, well, I died. <laughs> well, I'm actually not 100% sure for how long I've been recording this episode, because I forgot to set my timer. But three runs, making it on average to the third or the second floor, that seems like probably about the right amount of time. So that's going to wrap it up for today. As always, this has been Arisef. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.